you've been through, why you got scars Since you walked through the door, I've been trying to reach you Cause I feel you What's the story to tell, what's the story behind The mountain you're trying to climb Think of her Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, or if you are brand new here and this is the very first time you ever see in my face, what's up? I am Jen. I share all things health and wellness here on the channel. Anything I do to level up my own life, I share with you guys in hopes to inspire and motivate you to do the same. So if that sounds like your jam, make sure to subscribe before we jump into today's video. Alrighty guys, we have another weekly grocery haul and meal plan video coming at you guys. This one is not as huge from last week. Obviously, we stocked up on all the things that we needed from Sam's with a massive Sam's order. If you guys missed that grocery haul, I went in store, got a ton of goodies, so definitely definitely go check it out I'll link it up above but we hit up Walmart and Target this week and then a couple online goodies which of course I always show you guys because I do order quite a bit of stuff from online staples that I include in my daily diet so I always show you guys that stuff also but we got the necessities that we needed to keep us trucking along on our health journey feed the crew all of the things I won't be doing as massive of hauls each week that's what I'm hoping to do anyways because of doing the huge stock up at Sam's and then I'm also going to be trying to do Trader Joe's once a month and stock up on all of the things there and I'm hoping that will save trips to the grocery store as well as the budget and all of that and bring you guys some new ideas so anything that you guys want me to pick up or stuff that you guys are absolutely loving that you want to share with everybody else pop it down below I would love to hear it but without a ton of gabbing let's go ahead and jump into the haul okay we're jumping into Walmart first I'll pop the total up on the screen because I'm not sure what it is because they were actually out of a few things so I need to see what the new adjusted price is but we'll go ahead and jump right in we are making the mississippi pot roast again over fries which i posted a short here on youtube plus over on instagram i know a ton of you guys have tried it and absolutely loved it and obviously i loved it again because it's already back in the dinner rotation this stuff is so easy it's beyond delicious so definitely one you should try but i picked up this beef chuck tender roast i don't know if this one's going to be big enough i used quite a large one last time which was like the perfect amount for leftovers which it is absolutely delicious for leftovers as well and so I want to make a lot so I might actually end up picking another one of these up from Target they adjusted the size on this so I ended up getting a smaller one which is okay I'm gonna plug it in and see how many servings I get and I might add it to my Target order really quick so super pumped for that dinner picked up a couple pounds of the 93% lean ground beef got some of the super blend they have changed the packaging and brand I think this is the Fort Earth Farms this is what they put in for the super blend um, it's not actually it's looking like it might be on its last leg like I need to cook it right away but I didn't even have this on plan but I actually add it to the cart like every time I make a Walmart order just to see if they ever have it but it's out of stock usually about 95% of the time so I was surprised to see that they actually had it this stuff is delicious throw some protein with it and meal prep it's delicious for dinner or whatever the macros on it are super good clean fresh whole foods absolutely bomb 30 calories a serving so I was glad to see that in the order. Picked up some of the great value oven roasted turkey breasts. Got a humongous thing of the light Hidden Valley Ranch, which you guys know I've been loving and I'm almost out of my other one. So I picked up this big one. Got some more banana peppers for the Mississippi pot roast. Got one box of the Smart Food popcorn for little dude because we got a ton of snacks from Sam. So didn't need a ton of that, but he absolutely can't go without his popcorn. So we got one of those. Got a bottle of the Contadina pizza squeeze. I just love the convenience of this squeeze sauce and we're making pizza sliders this week. So I picked that up. Chick-fil-A sauce for the little dude. Couple bags of the shredded lettuce for lunch this week. Some rainbow carrots for a dinner. I absolutely love throwing these on a baking sheet in the oven. Super delicious and awesome side for dinner. Grabbed a couple of these great value flavored cream cheese. I wanted the blueberry and lemon zest that Nicole has been showing and says is absolutely delicious, but it was out of stock. So I grabbed this garden vegetable and strawberry because both of those sounded delicious as well. And then just like the super blend, I always throw this great cream cheese in the cart. Sometimes they have it, sometimes they don't, but when they do, I always like to stock up that way I have it in the fridge on hand when I want to make recipes grab some taco blend great value finely shredded cheese for taco Tuesday picked up some of this Carrie sugar-free syrup for the protein pancakes that I got from Sam's last week couple packs of the chocolate rice cakes because if you know you know got some more of the beefy onion recipe soup mix to go with the Mississippi pot roast a couple packs of the extra calf K cups for hubby and I I completely forgot to grab coffee last week so we were on the struggle bus with coffee but got a couple of them this week picked up two packs of the turkey pepperoni for pizza sliders this week 
Grabbed a pack of the Extreme Wellness Spinach and Herb Wraps for lunches this week. Picked up some Great Value Hamburger Buns for the little guy. And then some Sam's Choice Sweet Hawaiian Rolls. They don't have the Extraordinary Bites Rolls where I'm at. And they don't have the like lower calorie keto ones at my Aldi's. So these are 70 calories a serving and they're super good. So I went ahead and went with those for the pizza sliders this week. Then I have never tried this Monday Shampoo and Conditioner. It's supposed to be sulfate free and for more moisturize like color treated hair and stuff so just wanted to try that out if you guys have tried that or you have a good sulfate free shampoo that you really like let me know down below and then of course pizza lunchables for the little guy so that's everything from wally world now we'll go ahead and jump into target target is up next and as you can tell we only needed a few things to get us through the week from there a couple essentials that are specific to target so we'll go ahead and jump right in black and tyson chicken strips you guys know i don't have these anywhere around me target is the only place i actually haven't had these in a while but i'm not meal prepping this week and whenever i want a quick and easy lunch and i'm not meal prepping for the week because we have plans on sunday then this is just like an easy go-to so i'll be doing chicken wraps through the week and that's easy peasy throw these in the air fryer so if you guys have these around you highly recommend them got some protein pasta love the barilla got two boxes of the penne got some of the good and gather queso this is going on the mississippi pot roast fries if you guys missed that short definitely go check it out it's one of my most favorite dinners that i have had or made in like i don't even know how long it is the bomb.com and we have it back on the meal plan this week because it was so delicious picked up some of these guacamole single cups these are easier to have when you're like dipping and stuff rather than cutting a whole, a whole avocado and wasting it and it gets all brown and stuff quick and then the kids won't eat it that way so I went ahead and just grabbed some of the singles because they're convenient and easy for myself and my daughter then I picked up some of the good and gather mild sweet onion salsa this stuff is delicious 10 calories a serving some coleslaw mix for barbecue pork night then I got, I actually had some turkey sausage, the Great Value turkey sausage patties that you guys know I love from Walmart, but they were sold out. So I just went ahead and added some of this sausage. It's actually way better macros and price-wise it's easier just to make myself. So I'm going to prep some of these up for the week. Picked up some of these Ezekiel sprouted grain English muffins. These are like super clean ingredients and they are only 80 calories for one muffin. Half gram fat, 15 carbs, three fiber, and four grams protein. So... I will be having some of these through the week, plus my daughter wanted some of those. And then I also picked up some of the Dave's Killer Bread, which is also super clean and super awesome ingredients. This is the Cinnamon Raisin Bagels, which are 12 grams protein and 270 calories for one bagel. I have a half a bagel already pre-tracked for the week for breakfast, so I'll be putting some of that strawberry cream cheese that I got from Walmart on those. And then my daughter requested some of these chocolate frozen blueberries. These are 90 calories a serving. They're absolutely delicious and then also some of the Siete lime chips that we absolutely love. So that's everything from Target. Stocked up on some supplements this week and thank God they showed up in just in time because I just ran out of my Opti Green. So just got the new one, opened it up, filled it in my little container here. I have these linked in my Amazon store. They're absolutely awesome and they have like a little suction cup thing. They're perfect for the greens. I keep my reds in one too, but I still had some of them. Went ahead and got some more of the Microfactor. These are things I take every single day. Opti Greens, Opti Reds, micro factor and the full mega these omega threes are super good for heart health inflammation is the number one thing that i find that it helps with absolutely like won't go without these things foundational and then i picked up some glutamine this is something new i'll be incorporating in my routine i'll keep you guys posted on that but if you have any questions about this let me know always have a link down below over 75 bucks will get you free shipping Alrighty, folks here's what we're working with for this week's meal plan sunday we will be having orange chicken from trader joe's absolutely love having those frozen bags in the freezer for a quick easy night when you don't feel like cooking and you just want to throw something together quick they have been an absolute game changer and they're really delicious another delicious meal will be Monday. We already have this back in the dinner rotation because it's so bomb. If you guys missed that short, definitely go check it out. Highly, highly recommend. That's the Mississippi Pot Roast French Fries, but we're actually going to be doing it over mash this week and it will be bomb.com. Taco Tuesday is Taco Stuffed Sweet Potatoes, a super easy Taco Tuesday meal and it's absolutely delicious. Wednesday, of course, are leftovers. That's rest day from the gym, but a super busy work day. So we like doing leftovers. Just makes it easy on me. Not having to be in the kitchen and cooking and clearing stuff out of the fridge. 
Thursday will be barbecue pork with slaw. Friday's another one that I'm super excited for, kind of like the Mississippi pot roast fries. I'm gonna be doing ranch buffalo chicken fries. I'll be making a short for that also, so stay tuned for that. And then Saturday most likely will be date night. If not, it will be a leftover night. Not sure until this weekend comes exactly what we're gonna be doing, but either way, we'll either go out to eat or we'll have leftovers. And that'll do it for this week's meal plan. Let me know your guys' favorite dinners that you are throwing in your rotation this week. Pop them down below. If you guys enjoy these videos, make sure to give it a thumbs up. That definitely helps me out. Share it with anybody else you think it may be helpful to. If you aren't already part of the YouTube crew here, make sure to subscribe before you leave. And as usual, thank you so very much for watching, and I'll catch y'all in the next video.